moisture in the van. We have this desiccant dehumidifier by Ivation. And this one's great because it's still really effective in colder temperatures, which is usually when you want to use it in a camper van. We like it because it neatly fits under our bed. It doesn't make too much noise compared to a compressor dehumidifier. And it also throws off a little bit of heat, which is nice on colder days. The one downside is that it does take quite a bit of power, so we can't use it with our solar power system. We have to use it when we have access to shore power. But for us, if the van feels damp for a sustained period, plugging this in is a priority so we don't develop any mold issues. So this is our camp chair, it's the Flexlight Camp Dreamer from REI. When we were looking for chairs, we wanted something that could pack down pretty tight and that was also light as well so that we could take it to the beach or to the park. And this fits perfectly in our black box as you saw earlier. And it's, gr it's great and it's really easy to put together. Um, there's only a few s simple steps. So it does come with a headrest that you can put behind here and it connects, but I tend not to use it. Lisa does like it. And then it also has two cup holders where you can put your phone or your cup. Earplugs, I got these ones. They're actually meant for musicians. So you can still sort of hear with them, but they drone out most. It's a certain frequency that they're designed to drone out. Depending on where you're sleeping, if you happen to sleep at a truck stop or something like that, that's really noisy. It's nice to be able to throw these earplugs in and be able to get a good night's sleep. Some people argue that I've told this that, you know, what about for safety? I like to be able to hear around the van. You're still gonna hear if someone's banging on the door or people talking outside, but just sort of that, those repetitive sounds that are stopping you from falling asleep and keeping you maybe a little bit paranoid. It's gonna drone those out and let you get a much better night's sleep. So next up is solid shampoo and solid soap. These here are so handy when having a shower in the middle of nowhere. These are 100% vegan and biodegradable. They are plastic free, so they are super eco-friendly. Also, they take up no room. These equals to four bottles of shampoo and it's tiny. So for a van like this, this is literally perfect. Essential for us is a picnic blanket. Uh, we chose to have a picnic blanket instead of chairs because we spend enough time sitting down when we're working in here and when we're sat in the front as well. When a picnic blanket opens up the space, if you put it just outside your van, you can walk out without having to put shoes on and it just feels like you've got a little outside living room, which is really, really nice. This one that we have here is made from recycled plastic straws. My sister got it for us as a little moving into the van present. Um, but you can get any old picnic blanket. I'll leave a link in the description to your cheaper one, but this one is from life um, under canvas if you want the same one as us. 